What are the best MBA colleges in the world? In this video, we'll first list down the best MBA programs in USA, Canada, UK, Europe, Australia, Asia, including India. And then we'll talk about why this isn't really the right question to ask when you're starting your research. So watch till the end. Over the years, several reputed publications have come up with MBA rankings. Each publication uses a variety of criteria, including alumni ratings, post-MBA salary, ROI, class and faculty quality and diversity, among others. USA leads the world in the number of popular business schools. American MBA programs dominate most of the rankings. But there are many excellent MBA programs in other countries too, with varying formats and costs. When you have thousands of universities and MBA colleges to choose from, it helps to have a filter that will make your job a little easier. That's where MBA rankings can help. Rankings also help business schools establish their popularity and enhance their brand value. At a macro level, MBA rankings and the underlying parameters can provide insights into how the country and its economy values these advanced management degrees. Among the many rankings available, we have collated data from three sources that rank international programs. Keep in mind that these rankings change every year. So we have listed some of the top MBA programs that consistently get featured by prominent MBA rankings. The United States is the birthplace of the MBA degree. It has held on to its first mover advantage by housing some of the best MBA programs in the world. More than 50% of the top ranking business schools in the world are American. The majority of the full-time US MBA programs have a duration of two years and they accept relatively younger candidates compared to other countries. We'd recommend around three to five years of work experience while applying. Here's a list of the best MBA colleges in USA. Most of the non-US MBA programs, mainly in Europe and the UK, are one year in duration. These programs are relatively more intense and suited for experienced professionals with a slightly higher work experience, the average being around six to eight years. The advantages of a one year MBA would include lower costs, including tuition fees, living expenses, and the opportunity cost, making it a good choice for the budget and time constrained candidates. Here's a list of the best ranking MBA programs in Europe. The United Kingdom has some of the oldest universities. The familiar language, that's English, the multicultural society, and London being one of the economic and financial centers of the world, make the UK quite an attractive option for an MBA degree. Here's a list of the best MBA programs in the UK. Canada has become a popular MBA destination for international students. This is mainly due to the opportunity it provides to conveniently transition from studying to a legal working status. In addition, it also offers affordable education with world-class resources, a multicultural exposure and good living standards. Here are some of the top MBA colleges in Canada. Australia is gaining ground as a desirable MBA destination. Australia is pretty friendly about arranging for scholarships for deserving international students. An MBA from an Australian university can provide a rich intercultural experience, along with an opportunity to train in a competitive, world-class environment. One thing to note is that while the cost of an Australian MBA is somewhat lower than the leading MBA programs in the US, but its living costs are quite high. Here's a list of the top MBA colleges in Australia.
Top Asian MBA destinations include Singapore, India, China and Hong Kong. MBA programs in Asia offer a fantastic ROI in comparison with those from the US, UK or Europe. Here are some of the top MBA colleges in Asia. Okay, now that we've covered the best MBA programs in the world, let's come back to the other point we raised earlier. When you're just starting your MBA planning and research, is this really the question you should be asking? The answer is no. Let's take an example to understand why. Most would agree that Harvard Business School is among the most respected names in the world. But let's say you want to work in an Asia-based social impact fund. Sure, the Harvard brand can open up doors globally, but you may be able to accomplish the same career goals by choosing a top MBA college in Asia and at a fraction of the cost and time. The main point here is that the best MBA in the world may not be best for you. So while applying to MBA programs, use the rankings only as a reference. Remember that these rankings are based on certain parameters, so there's always a chance that there may be a mismatch with your aspirations. Make sure that you apply to programs where you fit in well. This means you need to do your research and select the MBA program that would be the right one to help you attain your post-MBA goals. At MBA Crystal Ball, our admission consultants have helped candidates like you get into many of the programs we have listed in this video. If you need any help in choosing the right MBA program and putting in a good strong application, don't hesitate to approach us. Good luck.